The community has been coming together to help out Fresno base ban Valkyrie Missile. They recently had their equipment stolen from their van last Friday. Full Circle Brewing Company hosted a benefit show for the band. Superstar Shayla E also donated a drum set to the band. And now we are joined by the members of Valkyrie Missile for an update on everything that's happened so far. Welcome, Nathan, James, Brennan, Tyler, and Michael. Welcome, all of you. How are you? Thank you. Good, good. Yeah, yeah, thank thank you. You. you guys are good? Good. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay, you have to tell us what exactly happened that day. You guys had a show, then what happened? So we play at um, Malone's in Santa Ana Friday night on the 3rd. Um, we went to a uh, Double Tree Hotel. They had us, for some reason, park outside of their complex. And, you know, obviously we wanted to feel comfortable, so we kept their, you know, they said they kept their word that those things would be safe. Okay. We woke up the next day on the 4th, um, and around 9, between 9 30, 10 o'clock in the morning, everything got stolen. Oh my goodness. So, like, like the vehicle, the U Haul trailer, and $20,000 worth of equipment. Wow, $20,000. Okay, James, tell us, how did that affect you guys? Um, it was unbelievable, really. Um, I mean, I'm the one actually discovered it. So I woke up and went outside, and then um, then it was just gone. And then I called Nate and was like, "Is did anyone move it? Anyone take it?" And he's like, "No, I just woke up." So oh my God. yeah, they had they actually broken into the vehicle and taken the entire unit. And it was just fear. And then at that point, we were also since they had our vehicle, we were stranded. Yeah. So it was just a million different emotions going on in our heads. Okay, Brennan, so what did you guys do next? Um, <clears throat> actually, I called, because uh, I originally thought it was towed. Okay. So I kept calling all these uh, tow yards in the area, and the ones that did answer, because it was on a Sunday, uh, mm -hmm. they were like, no, we don't have your car. Uh, so I was like, you know, I, I don't know. I think it might be stolen. And, you know, oh. you know Tyler was kind of like, hey, it's got to be in a tow yard. There's no way it was stolen. You know, it's a nice exactly. area. Yeah. And I was like, maybe, uh, but no. <laughs> oh, wow. The, the heartbreaking. It really is. And Taylor, okay, how has the community helped you guys? Uh, the, you know, they really reached out to us, you know, with donations, with instruments, and, um, you know, just helping us with our GoFundMe, you know. Um, like I said, we're just so thankful, you know, for all of their help and support, you know, just to kind of get us back on our feet. So. Exactly. And Michael, you guys had a special event this weekend, right? Tell us uh, a little yeah. bit about that. <clears throat> um, on the uh, 31st, we had like a benefit show. Uh, for us, we had a few other uh, local bands performing as well. And uh, it was actually a pretty good turnout. There was quite a bit of people there. Was, I was really surprised, honestly. Um, but yeah, the show went really good. Um, and. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't really know much else to say about it, but... <laughs> that it was a good like, show, right? Yeah, it was right? a good show, yeah. <laughs> Everything went good, so... Yeah, great show, a lot of yeah. friends, yeah. a lot of bands yeah. have been... Well, yeah. that makes been me happy. Forever. That's great, that's great. Mm -hmm. And then how did you guys feel when Shayla E donated to you guys? Um, Mind-blowing. Mm -hmm. That's honestly the only thing I can really think of, because it was just, you know, we were all just sitting in our house mm -hmm. with, you know, the empty practice room that we had, and then, you know, we've been, like, expecting a call from Santa Ana Police saying if they happen to have any updates. We got an L.A. number calling us, so we answer it, and it just so happens to be Sheila E.'s assistant. And um, once we figured out, like, who she was, because honestly, like, me, you know, I'm only 24. Mm. Like, I didn't really grow up much of listening to Sheila E., yeah. but then once I discovered who she really was, totally mind-blowing and... Um, she got to talk to us on the phone, and she was just saying how um, she was very sorry about what happened, and <laughs> she wanted to reach out an extended hand, and so she donated her um, DW Collector Series kit, and wow. we were all just, again, mind blown with everything, and she's so sweet of a person, yeah. super, super um, optimistic, and just very respectful, very nice. That's amazing. And of course, besides all that, you guys got some new guitars, right? Yeah. yeah tell us about that. Um, How do you pronounce the name of the guitars? Schecter Guitars. Schecter. I knew that. I knew it. Okay, tell me a little bit about they that. They actually uh, gave Nate a call, so I'm going to let. Yeah, so um, I believe one of the um, AR reps, his name is Anthony. Um, so he reached out to us on our GoFundMe page. Mm -hmm. And 
the he saw on our gear list that there was a couple of their products that got stolen. Okay. And so um, at first they were just saying like, oh, you know, whatever that was stolen, we'll replace. Um, but as time has gone, you know, um, me personally, I got to talk to Anthony and we got to know each other. And then I pretty much told him like how we're very dedicated and, you know, we're, you know, just trying to be as active as possible. And then they got to research more of how our band is and pretty much they thought that we had a lot of potential. and they gave us a, um, an endorsement deal with them and it was again a very mind-blowing feeling because we're all huge fans of Schecter um, products and so the fact that they're interested in having us as a development band yeah. is, is such an honor and we're awesome. and we are super proud to represent Schecter guitars. Okay now tell me what's going on in that photo right there on the screen. Okay, <laughs> so, so Anthony Love, um, he's, the, he's the artist relations representative. So he gave us um, a personal tour around the Schechter Guitars Research Facility. Mm -hmm. And that specific picture, um, he pretty much had all these guitars that were ready to be shipped. Or if anybody that was in the music industry that they needed to pick up a guitar that was like broken, like they, well, they broke themselves, but yet they needed a guitar that was already ready to go. Um, that guitar that I'm holding, the purple guitar, and then James holding is the gold guitar that Prince himself actually used and performed with. Wow. And so they let us um, hold on to it. We got to like, doodle on the guitar a little bit. Mm -hmm. And the bass that um, Tyler is holding, that's actually um, the bass that I would belong to Lemmy from Motorhead. Ooh. And the crazy fact about that was when that bass was supposed to be shipped to Lemmy himself, mm -hmm. Um, he ended up um, passing away a week prior to that, oh, wow. so he never got to play that bass. But we have to have the, op the opportunity to be able to hold on to that bass and got to take a picture with it. And we were all just like, again, mind blown. They just feel like family. Yeah, oh, it would definitely made us feel like family. I love it. I love it. You guys, thank you so much for sharing that story with us. We really appreciate you being here as well. And you thank know, you, you guys are working hard, so I'm yeah. pretty sure good things are coming for you guys. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> yeah, we are. We are definitely. Um, like you said, we pretty much have the majority of stuff covered. The pretty much all we need yeah. to take care of now is like amps, um, merch, and just pay off the debt that we owe. Yeah. But um, but thanks to the Fresno community, to the Central Valley, to everyone that's heard our story. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. We, it, we owe so much to you guys. You guys have given us unconditional love and support, and we will never give up. And Valkyrie and Soul will forever be strong that from anything that will stand in our way. We will keep going forward. Thank you, guys. You guys are awesome. I Thank love you. a good story.